Oh dear heavens. I'd better stay away from that entitled Karen forever. I need to mind my own business. What did you just call me? I called you an entitled Karen. You entitled Karen. Carrie. How dare you call me that name? You know that it's not a funny name at all. Listen, you entitled Karen. Do you want to mess with Jenny and her crew? I don't think so. Carrie, stop laughing at me and stop calling me an entitled Karen. If you call me that name one more time, my new crew and I are so going to beat you up. You're an entitled Karen, 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 you're an entitled Karen. Are you an entitled Karen? Entitled Karen, 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 entitled Karen. You are such an entitled Karen delinquent. What the hell, Carrie? How dare you call me that name nonstop and laugh at me for no reason? You know what? I am so going to beat your ass. and her new crew about this incident. This is what you get for calling me an entitled Karen and laughing at me nonstop. Now, if you excuse me, I need to look up child pornography on my laptop in the school's hallway. I hope you cry yourself for the rest of your life, Carrie. Carrie, are you okay? Why are you on the floor bawling? No, I'm not okay. Sage just sexually assaulted me because I called him an entitled Karen. Sage did what? Oh my god. Carrie, thank you for bringing this one up. Julie, Gavin, Amy and I will call the paramedics to pick us up and we'll take you to the hospital. Oh, I even witnessed when I was walking to class. Sage was not only in the possession of child pornography, but he is also in the possession of adult pornography as well. I think it's time that we all visit Sage when he is put in behind bars. What? Amy, you're serious that Sage was also in the possession of adult pornography as well? Yes I am dead serious, not gonna lie Gavin. Not to mention that Sage is missing out on all of the classes that he was supposed to take. No, freaking, way. Sage has completely gone way too far now. Jocelyn, please tell James about what happened. He's in the bathroom crying non-stop while being comforted by Darren. I will Gavin. Please tell Jared. Tracy and Jack about what Sage did as well. I will let Vincent and his crew as well as the cheer midnight meeps, the Molly gang, Bonquisha Parks and her two mothers Sabrina and Mia Parks, Waffles and her best friend Demi and the cheer destiny girls know that Sage viciously sexually assaulted Carrie just before he looked up child pornography on his own laptop. We're also going to tell this to her family as well. And we will see you later once you pick up Sage from school. I hope he gets officially expelled for all of these permanently. Thank you, Julie. Goodbye. Carrie, please don't cry. Everything will be okay. We're going to tell your family, as well as Vincent and his crew, the Cheer Midnight Meeps and the Cheer Destiny Girls. Right now we will be calling the ambulance to take you to the hospital. James, please don't cry. It's okay. It's okay. Please don't cry. James and Darren. Bon Keisha and I are super pissed off. Do both of you want to know why? Well, Sage Martel just sexually assaulted Carrie and sent her to the hospital just because she called him an entitled Karen. We totally agree what Jocelyn said. Bon Keisha saw and witnessed this with her own eyes, and she was really stunned that this happened today. Exactly. When our beloved daughter Bon Keyshaw was having a family lunch with us, she told us that Sage was sexually assaulting Carrie before he was looking up child pornography and adult pornography on his laptop. Not to mention that he likes to hurt innocent adults, children and does sexual assault on women and girls non-stop. I mean, 
He's seriously really getting out of balance right now. I agree with Mia. Not to mention that we also witnessed that Sage was also looking up adult and child pornography on his laptop. Sage did what? Oh my god. He has gone way too far now. I cannot believe that delinquent entitled Karen pedophile did all of these. James and I are so cutting ties with him. Oh my god. I can't take this anymore. I can't believe Carrie got assaulted by the delinquent untitled Karen pedophile right before he looked up child and adult pornography. Bon Keisha, Jocelyn, Mia and Sabrina, thank you girls for telling us about it. We're going to pick up Sage for what he did to all of the girls and children including Carrie. No problem. We're also telling his teacher Sakura Akamine everything he did to all the women he sexually assaulted and that he was also in the possession of child and adult pornography on his laptop. Not to mention that he also missed all of the school's subjects when he was looking up child and adult pornography on his laptop right after he sexually assaulted Carrie and even sent her to the hospital. When I get to my office after lunch, I am so going to confront and cut ties with him forever, and I am also going to get him expelled permanently for all of this. I know, right, Bonkisha? We'll tell nice Bernadette Stein about what Sage did as well. It's time that we all get him arrested forever right after we pick him up and defeat him. I swear, I don't know what is up with this guy who always sexually assaults women and girls. But he is really getting on my nerves. Sage, what on earth is taking you so long? I have been waiting for you to show up during... <laughs> Sage Martel, turn around right now. What? Oh no. Looks like I'm screwed. Ms. Sakura, I promise that this is not what it looks like. Really? Because it looks like you were sexually assaulting Carrie and sent her to the hospital at first, and now you were looking up inappropriate pictures of adults and children. Sage, are you a psychopath or something? But Ms. Sakura... No, I don't want to really hear it. In fact, give me your laptop and you are coming with me to the principal's office right now. Let's go. What? No. Not the principal's office. Yes. You're coming with me to the principal's office right now and that is a capital final. Get off your butt, give me your laptop and let's go. Hey Miss Sakura, Angela and I are back from the playground and I don't mean to interrupt what is going on here. Is it okay if I can borrow a computer charger? I left mine at home. What the heck? Oh my god. Sage, what in peace sakes are you doing? And why do you have that disgusting website on your computer? What the hell, Sage? Why on earth would you ever look up something this disgusting and horrendous on your laptop? Not to mention that you sexually assaulted Carrie. Do you even realize that it is illegal to sexually assault on women and girls and to look up or be in the possession of inappropriate photos and videos of adults and children? Thank you, Angela and Dora. But please let me take care of this situation. Now please go back to class. And Dora, there is a laptop charger on my desk if you girls need it. Okay, thank you Miss Sakura. We will go back to class. Yeah, but please do something about this pedophile who also does sexual assault on women and girls. Oh don't worry, I will do something about him. Now back to you. Bring me your laptop and come with me to the principal's office right now. Are you serious? You sexually assaulted Carrie and sent her to the hospital? And you were looking up child and adult pornography on your laptop? Sage Martell, what the heck? I can't begin to describe how pissed off at you. How could you do something this sick and despicable? Do you realize that it is illegal to sexually assault someone else and then search and look up or be in the possession of adult and child pornography? How could you do this? I swear. You, Dustin, and Michael are out of control. Just when I didn't think that Dustin and Michael couldn't get any worse, and they didn't look up adult and child pornography, but you happened to come along and search up inappropriate pictures of adults and children. I can't believe you right now, you entitled Karen. Yeah, Sage, you seriously have gone way too far this time. 
of all the things that Dustin and Michael have done, almost none of them held accountable for what you did. People like you piss me and everyone else off. I'm not even going to lie. That is so it. I am going to call your brother and your parents. Actually, Bon Keisha, you don't have to worry about that. I already contacted his parents and his brother as well as the police before we came to your office. Oh no. Not that stupid kid again who always does sexual assault on women and girls nonstop. Well, Principal Bon Keisha, what did my troublemaking delinquent brother do this time? Well, you will not believe what Sage has done. First, Sage sexually assaulted Carrie and then sent her to the hospital. And he was also caught in the school hallway by looking up inappropriate pictures of children and adults on his own laptop, in which his laptop is being confiscated and is now being destroyed for good. What? Did we just hear that correctly? You mean to say that he sexually assaulted Carrie and sent her to the hospital, and that he was looking up child and adult pornography on his own laptop? Yes, he was. Bonky Isha saw it with her own eyes. <laughs> um, Mom, Dad and Vincent, aren't all three of you going to say something? Sage, are you serious? You're looking up inappropriate pictures of minors on your laptop. Sage, we're beyond crossed with you. Do you even realize that doing sexual assault and looking up child and adult pornography are illegal? We can't believe it. How could we raise a child and adult predator who always does sexual assault on all women and girls? That does it, Sage. We have had enough of you permanently. As of today, you are being kicked out of the family forever. And I am also cutting ties with you forever because you not only did sexual assault on a woman and sent her to the hospital, but you were also in the possession of adult and child pornography as well. You are a big disgrace to the family and to society. We no longer want to be seen with you. Good riddance forever, you entitled Karen. No. Mom, Dad and Vincent. Please come back. I promise I won't do it again. Okay. We are right here to pick up Sage. So... We all just told nice Bernadette Stein about what Sage did, and she got a call from the school because someone did S.A. on Carrie and looked up C.P. and A.P. on his laptop. Correct? That's correct, Jared. Sage was caught by his teacher, Ms. Sakura Akamin, who was right next to me. Sage, are you kidding me? First you did sexual assault against Carrie, and now you were looking up child and adult pornography on your laptop. Why on earth would you ever do something this sick? Do you even realize that Carrie could have passed away in the hospital? You totally disgust us and everyone else in the whole society. I agree on what Jocelyn said. For all of this, you are under arrest for sexual assault and for being in the possession of child and adult pornography. And on top of that, we have also been hearing that you have also been doing sexual assault on other women like Alexine and Simona in the worst possible way and for bullying Tripp and his gang which is the total count of battery. So, we will be adding that to your charges as well. Oh, and one more thing, Sage. You will also be expelled from this school permanently. All right, Sage. Let's take you to the police station. Sage, you should be really lucky that Carrie did not die. Otherwise, Jenny and her crew would be in serious jeopardy. Good riddance forever, you entitled Karen. Don't ever come near to this school ever again. Man. I can't believe I got expelled from school and then got arrested. How could this day get any worse? Why?